Welcome to my Golden Games and welcome back to Forza Horizon 4. In this video, we're checking out the James Bond car DLC. This episode is specifically for the Aston Martin DB5. This car is freaking beautiful. Look at it. Uh, I just realized it's uh, kind of lagging right now. Okay, now that the game is unlagging, for some reason it, it likes to lag because this is on Windows 10, so it's still not 100% optimized for the PC. Then again, I'm also running in 4K. I'm recording a 1080p, though. You guys know the story. Anyways, this car is freaking sick looking. Uh, so it does have the bulletproof windshield deflector behind us there. Uh, we'll check that out in the garage. Let's go in first person really quick, see what the car looks like. That is beautiful. Hopefully you guys will enjoy this episode. If you do, hit that like button. That helps me out when you do that. There's a few other things this car has like an ejecto cedo cuz um we'll check that out again later in the garage let's go take this car for a spin before we check out all the gadgets this car has it'll be a second here listen oh listen to that oh that is beautiful and the thing that's nice about this we're actually in england right now so we can pretend we're james bond oh Ooh, listen to that engine roar Ooh. Now, this thing is unmodified, so it is the stock James Bond DB5. Ooh, man, it's got some good torque. It does have some good horsepower. Ooh, listen to that beautiful engine. Let's drift around this corner, James Bond style. That was horrible. I'm gonna try to drift this car around this corner here. I think that's a good amount of speed. Come on, oh, no, no, oh, man. I cannot seem to drift this car. I've actually tried like four or five times now. Uh, we'll, we'll find another spot where we can drift around. There, oh, oh, there, oh, had a little drift going there. As you can see, I'm still a little rusty on this car. I can drift really well in that Dodge Challenger. Damn it, it's a Dodge Charger. Let's try and, nope, that is not, nope, I, you know what it is? It's the, uh, right-hand view. It's throwing me off. Ooh. Let's go in third person now and see if I can drift this car. Uh, we'll drift it around this way. Nope. Nope. This car, I cannot seem to drift it. Ooh, man, look at the rear tires, though. Ooh. The front ones have the spikes as well. The, uh, you know, in the movie, they stick out and then pop enemy tires. You know how it is in James Bond. Okay, now that I've uh, kind of humiliated myself by not being able to drift it, let's head back to the house, pull into the garage, and check out all the gadgets that this car has. Oof, this sounds great. Nope. Oh, man. Boom. Where'd I go? I disappeared. I am gone. Yeah, so I'm having a really difficult time drifting this car. Then again, it is stock, so if I upgraded the uh, uh, sway bar and everything, that should give me some better traction. But let's get back in our house here. Oof, just going first person for this. And we're going to pull inside our house. Oh, man, that is beautiful. This game is seriously a gorgeous-looking game. All right, let's go inside the garage. Let's turn the headlights on. Ooh, that looks freaking beautiful. Now, let's see. What can we actually do to the bumper? Oh, does that push out? Oh, that is sick. The machine guns pop open there. I believe those are machine guns. You know what? Maybe not. I don't remember. Let's see what we could do to this front end here. Uh, no, 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 that just, it's a suave car, it's a classy car, you did not, you, no, that is plastic, I do not want to put that on my car. Alright, so let's walk around here, and we got, okay, so we can change the spray paint, so now this, we can remove the top, and, boom! So as you can see, the ejection seat comes out that hole right there. And like he used in the movie, I believe it flipped the car back over. Unless it was another James Bond movie. There's, what, over 40 James Bond movies? I've seen them all, of course, but it's it's been a while. I should probably re-watch them all. That's going to take forever. Boom! There we go. In case you start getting shot at from behind, you just push the button there and that pops right up. It's a ballistic panel, basically a steel, and it just stops all the bullets from coming through. Uh, we can change the license plate. I'm not going to do that right now. 
Uh, we can actually flip that. Ooh, look at that. Um, so yeah, I actually don't know what those do under the tail lights. Like in the front did the same thing. I don't remember what those actually do. But either way, that's cool how it actually pops out and everything. We can change the bumper as well, but we'll take a look at that later. Let's see, can we open the hood? That's kind of disappointing. You can't actually open the hood to look at the engine. I'm, I, I am sad about that. Get yeah, the front anti-roll bars. We definitely want to upgrade that because what we had, that was not doing us any good. Definitely do not want to add that, but we will add that. Install that. Hello? Yeah. Nope. No, because we already ate, and I'm trying to get a video done. Well, why don't, why don't you go to Clippy's with us? Okay. Okay. Well, I got to get this done. Okay. Okay. Okay, bye. Okay, so we'll cut it there. Let's get around here to see what we can do to the tires. So we can get street tires, sport tires, race tire, okay. Horizon race tire compound. That's pretty good, actually. Ten thousand dollars? Yeah, man. I'm only I've only got seventy one thousand right now. I put a lot of money into my Jeep Wrangler and the uh, Ford Raptor. Rally tire compound, drag tire, vintage rice tire tire compound. That's probably what we want to go with. But those stock tires, that looks really good. Anyways, we'll leave that alone for now. I'm not going to mess with the suspension or anything. Let's see what kind of modifications we can do to the rear end. So we got a rear wing. Ugh, why? Why would you, that just destroys the car? We definitely want to get this rear sway bar, or anti-roll bar. There we go. So that should help us out a lot in doing those drifts. Now let's enter the car and see what the interior looks like. So you just open the door there. And now when you're actually inside, you can look at the interior a little better than when you're actually driving the car. Uh, so let's close the door. Ooh, that's nice. Okay, and let's see. We got the horn. I'm not going to mess with the horn right now. We can turn the car on. Ooh, that sounds good. All right, so now that the engine's running, we can rev it up. Ooh, that is beautiful. And then we still have the top open there. And then we can actually look back here. That pops open. You got the little red button there on the shifter. That's the ejecto -cido. And then we got all these things here. Bullet screen, plates, uh, rear, front. Okay. Smoke screen, M guns, nails, and oil. So that's right. That's what comes out the rear tail lights, the oil and the nails, and the smoke. And then the front is the machine guns. Man, this is such a freaking beautiful car. It'd be cool if you could actually use the machine guns in the game, but you, you can't. At least not right now, I don't think. Unless it's like a hidden feature somewhere. Oh, man. And then he's got the speaker down there. I believe he used that to uh, talk to, like, M or Q or somebody. I feel so bad. It's just, it's been a long time since I've watched James Bond. But anyways, let's uh, take this car out for a spin again. Now that we got those new anti-roll bars in the front and the rear... Let's see if we can take this car around these corners a little better. Oh, that's already handling a lot better. Okay, let's get on the road. Oh, okay, okay, there we go, there we go. And let's drift it. There we go. See, that's handling a lot better already. I can definitely feel a huge difference now. And then again, it's got the stock tire compound, which is, you know, like 60 years old almost. 50 years old. So... Oh, 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 there we go, there we go. Oh, nope, nope, we lost it, we lost it. 
Ooh, let's talk about a smoke screen. <laughs> oh man, this is a beautiful car. I hope you guys are enjoying the episode so far. I think I'm gonna leave it here because this was just more of a showcase of the car. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Have a great day, guys, and see you next time. Hit that like button if you did enjoy it. Take it easy, guys. Ba da ba da ba da da ba da ba da da ba da ba da ba da da ba 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 ba da ba ba da ba da ba there we go. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah. Ba da ba da da. Ba da ba da ba da da. There we go. We did the 180. Actually, that's a 360, technically, isn't it? Uh, yeah, 360. I was doing that in Grand Theft Auto all the time. Grand Theft Auto 4. I haven't done that in forever in Grand Theft Auto 5. If you guys want me to do that in an LSPDFR video, let me know in the comments below. All right, guys. Take it easy.